What's next for Andre Berto? To be quite honest, I would like Andre Berto to hang the boxing gloves up and retire for good. I think Andre Berto was well past it. I mean, Andre Berto was past it long ago. I mean, like when he fought Floyd Mayweather, for example. He don't have the best chin in the world, but he's done okay for himself. He's won. I'm sure he's made good enough sums of money, maybe even life-changing sums of money. He's got uh, revenge on Victor Ortiz, and he's fought Floyd Mayweather. He was never going to beat Floyd Mayweather, but he got that uh, fight, even though I don't deserve he should have got it. There's no nothing really out there for him. Maybe a rematch with Devin Alexander. I think would be a good idea. Uh, apart from that, maybe a, a, a Amir Khan, Sammy Vargas winner, or that's really all I can think of in terms of who you can fight next. If he fights Errol Spence or Danny Garcia and he's ready for Sean Porter, or if he fights Keith Thurman. All of them probably knock him out or stop him or beat him convincingly anyway. I don't see any way in, any chance of Berto beating any of the guys I've mentioned. Maybe a rematch of Alexander makes sense. Maybe it's the best move for him. And the money, I can imagine, would be very good. I can imagine it would be very good money as far as things go. Um, that's what I think. What else is there for him? He's been beaten, knocked out or whatever. Has been knocked out, he's been beat. Yeah, well, he's been stopped and he's been beat by guys like Robert Guerrero. I mean, come on, Robert Guerrero. No disrespect, but if you're getting beat to Robert Guerrero at welterweight, now beating, getting beat at Robert Guerrero at the lighter weights, is more, it's not as bad because he was better at them weights. But be, getting beat by Robert Guerrero at Walter Reed, I mean, that means you mustn't, you're never going to be at the top of the Walter Reed division if you're getting beat by Guerrero. Guerrero was never really a top 10 guy himself in the Walter Reed division. Floyd beat Guerrero with relative ease. I mean, Floyd beats a lot of hunts with relative ease, but. He really put a beating on uh, Robert Guerrero. Uh, so, yeah, retirement for Burrow or the rematch with Devon Alexander. That's the only two choices.